Brazil stunned Spain to reach Olympic women's football final. Brazil stunned World Cup holders Spain in their Olympic women's football semi-final on Tuesday winning 4-2 to set up a showdown with the United States in the gold medal match. An Irene Paredes own goal gave Brazil an early lead in Marseille and Gabi Portilho doubled their advantage in first half stoppage time. Adriana made it 3-0 in the second half before a frantic finish saw Spain pull goals back by a Aduda Sampaio own goal and a Salma Paralulo effort while Carolyn got Brazil's fourth. Brazil are now guaranteed to at worst match their previous best showing in the Olympic women's football when they won the silver medal in 2004 and 2008. On both occasions they lost to the United States who they meet again in Saturday's final at the Parc des Princes in Paris. Meanwhile Spain who are making their debut at the Games a year on from winning the World Cup for the first time face Germany on Friday in Lyon in a playoff for bronze. Brazil had scraped through their group as a best third place team despite losing their last pool match to Spain a game in which their legendary captain Marta was sent off. She missed the quarter-final win over hosts France as a result and was again suspended here but Brazil ultimately did not need her in either game. The sixth-minute opening goal was farcical with Spain goalkeeper Catacal blasting a clearance off Paredes and looking on as the ball ricocheted into the net. Portilho who scored the only goal against France in the last round converted a cross from the left to make it 2-0 to Brazil right at the end of the first half. Adriana came off the bench to seemingly put the game to bed on 71 minutes scoring moments after her first attempt struck the crossbar. Duda Sampaio deflected a Paralulo header into her own net as Spain reduced the deficit late on but Carolyn slotted a fourth for Brazil through the legs of Cal to end any doubt about the outcome as the match headed into a lengthy spell of injury time. Paralulo made it 4-2 but it was a night to forget for Ballon d'Or winner Etana Bonmati and her teammates even if they could still leave the Olympics with a medal.